Hey everyone, thanks so much for tuning in. My name is Dr. Ryan Shelton. A question recently came in, which is a common question. Is eating eggs healthy for you? So this conversation came up actually in the 1970s, 1980s, 1990s, when doctors and researchers showed that cholesterol had a link to cardiovascular disease, stroke, heart attack, diabetes. New research has shown that cholesterol, dietary cholesterol intake has very little to do with your risk factors for those chronic diseases. So cholesterol is basically a paste that the body uses, the body produces cholesterol, but it's not the culprit. It's not the underlying culprit for all of these chronic issues. Inflammation is the culprit. So inflammation causes damage to blood vessels and the body uses cholesterol basically as a paste to try to protect itself from further damage. And th there was a lot of interest in the 70s, 80s, and 90s about dietary cholesterol intake. And of course, eggs have a considerable amount of cholesterol, specifically in the yolks. Research in the last decade have has clearly shown that the intake of eggs has virtually no increased risk factors for these chronic diseases, cardiovascular disease, diabetes, stroke, Alzheimer's. We know that eggs are a complete protein. They're high in choline and lutein, both of which are great for eye health, nerve transmission, cell signaling. One study showed that the intake of eggs on a daily basis had no effect on plasma cholesterol or blood cholesterol. Another study has shown that there's no effect on increasing risk factors, daily intake of eggs for cardiovascular disease, metabolic syndrome. Another study in Korea showed that the daily intake of eggs actually decrease the risk of metabolic syndrome. A study done on a Mediterranean cohort showed that there were no changes in blood cholesterol or triglycerides. Another study has shown that the daily intake, the daily consumption of eggs actually improves the good HDL cholesterol to bad LDL cholesterol ratios. Now, yolks and and egg whites are certainly separate. But another very cool study has shown that including the whole egg, both yolks and whites, actually improves your body's potential to increase muscle protein. So avoiding the yolks, which is higher in cholesterol, may diminish that effect. We know that certain proteins like red meat increase the risk factors of cardiovascular disease and diabetes, but uh, studies have shown that eggs do not. When my patients ask, are eggs healthy to eat? I say absolutely. We want to try to limit it to basically one egg per day, seven per week, something like that. But eggs are not the culprit. Inflammation is the culprit. Eggs are a complete protein. They're high in nutrients like choline and lutein. I would certainly speak to your physician. If you have very high cholesterol already, you may want to talk to them about uh, limiting that egg consumption a little more. Uh, but the research shows that approximately one egg per day or seven per week averaged out over the week has no negative effect on uh, cardiovascular disease, on diabetes, on Alzheimer's disease. So when my patients ask, are eggs healthy? I say, absolutely. Of course, it depends on how you cook them too. Uh, boiled is a a simple answer. It doesn't have all of the added fat when you fry an egg. Uh, scrambled, because you can include 
uh, cool vegetables that have antioxidant effects, but eggs are healthy. Don't be scared of them. This is a myth that came out uh, 30, 40 years ago, so uh, consider yourself just fine to eat eggs uh, on a daily basis. Thanks so much for tuning in. I want your feedback. I want more ideas and questions. I love it when these questions come in. Make sure you like this post and you share it with your friends and your loved ones.